All right, guys, got a quick unboxing from a, a old school buddy of mine, or OG, I guess, if you will, uh, Jonathan, who was I met a long time ago back in the uh, Urban Gentry Facebook group back in the day, and found out he was in Michigan, and I'm also in Michigan. We've, we've met up before. He actually helped me out with a project I was doing back in the day. That was a uh, Chop Top Challenge car. Maybe I'll add a picture of that car in the uh, at the end of the video if you guys might get a kick out of that. That was a pretty fun little project, and he helped out with that with some lighting. So he sent over his full titanium meteor dial, and uh, this is the Hampton Kraken uh, version 2, I think. Such a great watch. I mean, I fell in love with the first one, and then they did the Kickstarter and had a huge, massive success in it. And I'll, I'll, I'm going to do a full video on this and I want to talk more about Hampton and the uh, the owner, I think it's Ross is his name, um, about what happens because I've, I've followed and have taken part in some other Kickstarters for different, um, well, what the one of the first ones I did was actually called The Coolest. I don't know if any of you guys are, knew about that, but there's like this weird thing that happens when your Kickstarter or campaign or whatever you want to call it, Indiegogo or whatever, when they blow up and they do way better than you think they're going to, there's some serious production issues. There's, um, it complicates things to say the least. And he upgraded some things and I know there was a lot of unhappy people, but ultimately once you got one of these and they were fully produced, I think it's a phenomenal watch. It's a very good watch. Like I said, I'll do a video on it here soon. I believe he ended up doing ceramic. Yeah, you can kind of feel them in there. It has um, ceramic bearings in the bezel action. And then, of course, like the meteor dial. It's uh, full titanium, which is awesome. And I think I believe it must have some sort of scratch-resistant coating on it as well. Because I know Jonathan wore this and it's not all scratched up. Nice bracelet on it. Looks like screw links, very fine hardware. So I'm excited to do the video on this one because this is the first time I've checked out a fully loaded one. Plus it comes with this other strap. So I'll get that done as soon as I can. And um, check out this picture. I'll put it at the end. I'll see you guys on the next vid.